for engineering services general studies video lectures visit www.isgeneralstudies.com for mechanical engineering video lectures and question and answers discussion visit www.getmec.com so let us take one example here 1023 minus 14568 say this is a matrix called a okay there is one definition trace what is the significance we will see later when we are going through eigenvalues and eigenvectors trace is defined as the sum of trace is defined as the sum of elements along its diagonal of a matrix usually called this is the main diagonal or principal diagonal so sum of elements along main diagonal this is defined only for a square matrix only what is a trace a trace is trace of a matrix now trace this we can call it as trace of a say suppose what is trace of a here trace of matrix a is equal to 1 plus minus 1 plus 8 this is equal to 8 so the trace of a is here 8 so how trace is defined trace is defined as the sum of the elements along its main diagonal this is the main diagonal okay this is the diagonal basically so sum of elements along its main diagonal is called the trace for example <coughs> a is this what would be a transpose I will write rows as columns, correct right? So 1, 0, 2, 3, minus 1, 4, 5, 6, 8. As I have already explained you, the diagonal elements for A and its transpose for any matrix, the diagonal elements of any matrix and its transpose matrix remains the same. So the trace shall also remain the same. So trace of A transpose would be what? Trace of a transpose is equal to 1 plus minus 1 plus 8 1 plus minus 1 plus 8 earlier for trace of a also has 1 plus minus 1 plus 8 so this is nothing but 8 so trace of a is always equal to trace of its transpose okay why because the diagonal remains same for a matrix when it is transposed okay so regarding trace of the matrix what we have discussed just now we have already told one property of it trace of any matrix a is equal to trace of its transpose a transpose okay simply to write i will write trace of a is equal to trace of a transpose one more important thing is say suppose a is equal to 1 2 3 4 b is equal to 5 6 7 8 what is a plus b 1 plus 5 6 2 plus 6 8 3 plus 7 10 4 plus 8 12 what is the trace of a plus b here what is trace trace of a first here 1 plus 4 what is trace of b here 5 plus 8 13 what is trace of a plus b 6 plus 12 18 if you add actually trace of a plus trace of b that is also equal to 18 only trace of a plus trace of b this is equal to 5 plus 13 this is also equal to a which is nothing but equal to trace of a plus b if you observe carefully in a plus b what you are doing is you are just adding the elements to its corresponding elements in trace of in a plus b 1 1 element 2 2 element for for, for, for finding the trace what you are doing is you are actually adding the elements across the diagonal so 1 1 1 1 
2 2 2 2 so in a plus b effectively while finding the trace you are adding these two this is nothing but the sum of 1 1 of a position 1 1 element 1 1 of a and element 1 1 of b that's why trace of a plus b is always equal to trace of a plus trace of b so trace of a plus b is always equal to trace of a plus trace of b since you are simply adding the elements here third property is say suppose trace of some constant into matrix a what it would be say suppose here a is this one say suppose 3a i will take what is 3a 3 into 1 3 3 into 2 6 3 into 3 9 3 into 4 12 what is trace of 3a here trace of 3a here is 3 plus 12 that is 15 okay it is trace of a is actually 5 so this can be written as 3 into 5 which is nothing but 3 into trace of a so 3 into a so trace of 3a is equal to 3 into trace of a okay so here trace of any constant into matrix a is equal to constant into that trace of the corresponding matrix similarly if you can check trace of a plus a into b is always equal to trace of b into a okay shall we check it here what is a into b here quickly a into b 1 5 plus 2 into 7 5 plus 14 19 1 into 6 plus 2 into 8 16 plus 6 22 3 into 5 plus 4 into 7 15 plus 28 43 3 into 6 18 plus 32 8 into 4 50 so trace of ab is 19 plus 50 69 what is b a b is 5678 into i will write it side by side for us to do it clearly i will write it here b is 5678 a is 1234 why can't we write it there only instead of here i will write it b is 5 6 7 8 a is 1 2 3 4 so it is 5 into 1 5 plus 18 33 sorry 5 into 1 5 plus 18 23 5 into 2 10 plus 24 34 7 plus 24 31 14 plus 32 44 I think I have written wrong. Is it same? 5 plus 6 into 3, 18 plus 5 is 23. Yes. So 14 plus 32, 46. So now what is it? Okay. From here, what is the trace of? B A is 23 plus 46 69 you can observe here trace of A B is equal to trace of B A actually trace of for higher order A B C is equal to you should not change the order in which you are being uh, the matrix are being multiplied okay for example I will write it as a circle pattern A b c say suppose this is the circle like this so you can multiply in the same circle wise then the trace won't change so trace of a a b c is equal to trace of b c a is equal to trace of start from c now c a b this will always remain same if you change the order 
here the order whatever is there is a b c was the order we are following like this if you change the order b c instead of b c a b s if you write this is not equal to the change in order trace of b a c or a c b like that if you change the order that will not be equal unless you change if you don't change the order all the trace remains same similarly for four matrix say suppose a b c d again you write it in the form of a circle a b c d without changing its order if you multiply maintain only one cycle then trace of a b c d will be equal to b c d a trace of b c d a shall be equal to start from c c d a b trace of c d a b start from d trace of d a b c so without changing the cycle then all the trace would be if you multiply any number of matrices the trace would be equal for engineering services general studies video lectures visit www.isgeneralstudies.com for mechanical engineering video lectures and question and answer discussion visit www.getnet.com